Hello, elementary Chinese part at Shanghai China Ken. Jenny, you're being very <laughs> minimalistic today. I'm getting to the point. Jenny, tell us more. Oh, do you know that girl? Do I know that girl? Um, we are, I believe, on the university campus. Someone is seeking to to get to know a certain girl. That's right.、Mm, uh, so today's lesson is, of course, not restricted to university students. Well, a lot of the language, I mean, all the language in, in, in the newbies and the LAs are really flexible in terms of they could be used in many, many, many contexts、yes. because they're high frequency、mm. stuff. But yeah, we're at a university, maybe a, in a club or something at the you know a dancing. Place in the club.、Mm. What do I know? What happens in the university these days? But anyway, that's where we are.、Uh, let's listen to the exchange three times. We'll come back and we will、uh, look into it in more detail. 对话第一遍。你认识那个女孩吗？哪个？那个，很漂亮的。哦、oh, ，她是三年级的。你帮帮我吧。我想跟他见面，不行，他是我哥哥的女朋友。第二遍，你认识那个女孩吗？哪个？那个，很漂亮的。哦，她是三年级的。你帮帮我吧，我想跟他见面。不行，他是我哥哥的女朋友。第三遍。你认识那个女孩吗？哪个？那个，很漂亮的。哦，她是三年级的。你帮帮我吧，我想跟她见面。不行，她是我哥哥的女朋友。好 ，today's lesson is quite useful to describe people. Okay, that's true. Very good. So why don't we translate? 你认识那个？女孩吗、uh, ？Do you know that girl？ 你认识那个女孩吗 ？Do you know that girl？ 你认识那个女孩吗？哪个 ？Which one？ 哪个 ？Which one？ 哪个？那个，很漂亮的。That one, the 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 beautiful one。那个，很漂亮的。That one, the the pretty one。那个很漂亮的，哦，她是三年级的。哦、uh, ，she's a, a third year student。哦，她是三年级的。啊、uh, ，yeah， she's a third year student。哦，她是三年级的。你帮帮我吧，我想跟她见面。啊、uh, ，help me out here， I want to meet her。你帮帮我吧，我想跟她见面。啊、uh, ，Give me some help here. I want to meet her. 你帮帮我吧，我想跟她见面。不行，她是我哥哥的女朋友。啊、uh, ，No way. She's my older brother's girlfriend. 不行，她是我哥哥的女朋友。No, sorry. She's my older brother's girlfriend. 不行。她是我哥哥的女朋友。Okay. Hmm. Sad, unrequited love. Well, it happens. <laughs> it doesn't. I'm not sure if it's unrequited love, but <laughs> it's a, at least vague interest. Um. Now, this isn't terribly difficult、uh, from a vocabulary perspective at the LE level,、mm. but there are some nice patterns in it. Yes. All right. Now, let's look for those patterns. Sure.、Uh, let's take it from the top. 你认识那个女孩吗？你认识那个女孩吗 ？Now the verb to recognize to know in that sense is 认识，认识，认识。Now the tones there are fourth and neutral. Fourth and neutral. Yes. And quite often people will say somebody's name and case could say something like 认识不认识。对。Do you know that person?、Mm, right? 认识吗 ？Now and we have to make it clear that 认识 means you. Personally, yes. No, not just a matter of you recognize them. Exactly. Yeah, range as in you have you're an acquaintance. Let's、mm, say. Yeah. 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 And of course, that girl、uh, in the expression here is. 那个女孩儿，那个女孩儿。Now tell us about this. 那个，那个
basically means that one. That one. So it's mm. fourth tone. Yes. Yeah. Uh, and girl is, I guess, using the same way as English. I mean, clearly this is a young woman. And, and yeah. She's 20, probably mm. something. But, but we still use. Still used. Yeah. New heart. New heart. Good. And so when you want to form a question, how, how was that done? Na ge. Na ge. As in which, which one? one? And it's clear that that's a question there. Yep. Right? Yeah. Now, and to contrast that once again with that one. Na ge. Na ge. So could you contrast the two things, the question which one, with the expression that one? Mm. The question is na ge. Na ge. Na ge. And the answer Naga. 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 Okay, it takes a little bit of practice, but it's uh, it's there. So you could listen over a couple of times to that. Okay, so that one, the beautiful one. Yeah, um, fairly straightforward, right? Yes. The, the, mm. the beautiful one. Yeah, yeah. Okay, now she's a third year student. The implication, of course, is university students were not in <laughs> primary school. school. Yeah. God, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she's a third year student. Oh, she's a third year student. Yeah, so she's a year three mm. student. Yes. Um, uh, meaningful, I guess, in the context of students talking to other students. Again, I guess that's an important thing if yeah. you're a freshman. She's a third mm. Whatever. Anyway, he, that's just one, one way to describe her. Uh, now, so the guy's interested and he's like, Get, help me out here. You now the verb to help is bang, bang. Bang, first time. Yes. All right. So help me out here. 你帮帮我吧. So this is a it's a nice sort of uh, informal expression. Yeah. Right. So, it's loose. Mm, when we double, we duplicate the verb, it softens the tone, makes yeah. it more casual. That's and right. Friendly. And the particle at the end continues to do so yes. it's like it's almost like oh i need help me out here i need mm. some help uh yeah. yeah why don't you help i guess out. he just doesn't want to sound desperate or something <laughs> he's like oh help me out here anyway so it's a good expression and it is very expressive while we're at it so let's hear it again please jenny yeah so i want to meet her now this washang great phrase can work in a million contexts literally translated meaning I want to I want mm. now the tone on this xiang is third tone yeah xiang xiang yes so I want to I would like to uh, now this is a good expression to meet with her 跟他见面 跟他 no, genta, two first tones here. Yes. I mean, with her. Yep. And then the verb comes at the end. 见面. 见面. Mm. Also pay attention to the syntax. 跟他见面. Yeah, mm. great phrase can be used in many, many. You know, tomorrow I'm going to meet some, some colleague or say, you could say. Uh, 跟同事见面。见面, mm. So it's with him connect, with her meet, whatever. Mm. It's good. Now, the verb to actually to meet is. 见面. 见面. Yes. Two fourth tones. Yep. What do these elements mean literally, please, Jenny? Well, 见 means to see. Yep. And 面 means face. Face, to see face. face. There mm. you go. Good little mnemonic. 见面, see face. 见面. <laughs> uh, I don't know why that works as a mnemonic, but it does for me for some reason. 见面, two fourth tones. So this phrase is really useful. So I'd like to meet her. 我想跟他见面 Okay mm. Now, 不行, not going to happen 对, no way yeah, 不行, so, 不行. Uh, Because 他是我哥哥的女朋友 Yeah 他是我哥哥的女朋友 So the ge of course, the older brother Yes And that's his girlfriend So she's certainly not going to go in 对 Make the introduction mm. Wow, okay Why don't we listen to this three more times? Welcome back to another installment of Chinese Pod Trivia. And the question for you is, for what test does Chinese Pod offer preparation services for? Is it A, the polygraph, B, the colonoscopy, C, the HSK test, or D, the CAT scan? Uh, the CAT scan? Ooh, sorry, that is incorrect. The correct answer is C, the HSK test. That's right, ChinesePod will thoroughly prepare you to pass this rigorous test of proficiency in Chinese. 
ChinesePod.com forward slash HSK. Nihirma? 哦，他是三年级的。你帮帮我吧，我想跟他见面。不行，他是我哥哥的女朋友。第三遍，你认识那个女孩吗？哪个？那个很漂亮的。哦，她是三年级的。你帮帮我吧，我想跟她见面。不